This is Andrew from Gemba Red. Uh, today we're looking at two LED floodlights. They both look pretty identical. They're 50 watt LEDs. Um, but this is an important point because you're going to see a lot, a lot more floodlights on the market, out on the streets and everywhere. They're going to be very bright. The white lights that everyone is concerned about, the blue light hazard and uh, the flicker effect. But these two identical looking lights, we can really tune them to be more beneficial to our biology. So here we've, we've got a standard white light, and here's the one that I made some special specifications on. So I'm gonna turn them on. So immediately you see the bright white light, it's probably flickering quite a bit. It's flickering, a lot of flicker and flicker. And this one, if you can still see, aside from the flicker coming from this one, there's no flicker, right? So we're gonna get up close and look at this. And this one is the bright white, you know, it's gonna be, it's you know, leaving dots in my eyes right now. And then this is actually, I specified a 630 nanometer wavelength. So we got 630 nanometer wavelength, low flicker. Flicker? You know, we can, we can really, tune these lights to whatever we want so we can control them to our biology, we can make them a lot healthier and bring these in. So we're just going to bring it in a little bit closer. I keep it this still on. So you can see. Oh. See here a lot of flicker. Actually, we'll angle it actually a little bit away. And then we see this. Oh, here you can see the flicker. That waviness that's moving back and forth. A lot of flicker. You can see it in, yeah, here we go. Now we see a lot of flicker. These bright white lights leaving uh, Dots in my eyes. See a lot of the flicker there. And then here is the red light. I can shine it right up here. There's no interference, no flicker with the light. Look at the reflection. There's no flicker. 